Ready for go for a walk? Is that what you want to do? You want to go for a step? Okay. Okay. We go for a walk then. Yes. Okay. Okay. We are outside going for a walk. All right. So anyway, this is kind of like an audition type of thing. Uh, just to kind of show Kyle what I can do on um, video editing. He's actually wanting to hire me as his video editor, maybe. And uh, he would like to have me edit uh, like MMA, weight loss videos, and uh, like gaming videos, which is cool because I pretty much kind of specialize in those departments, you know. I mean, you know, I know a little bit about MMA, but I know a lot about weight loss and I know a lot about uh, workouts and a lot about uh, gaming, that's for sure. So, and then a lot about editing, so um. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm gonna need I'm gonna need for extra money right now. Um, taking on a job with lesser pay, 13 an hour instead of 18 an hour. And at 18 an hour, I was living kind of like barely within my means. So I need some extra cash to make this work. And the schedule <clears throat> at my new job may be sporadic which is gonna be kind of hard to take on a part-time job so I need like some kind of work where I can just do it whenever and video editing is perfect because I could literally do that every day especially if I only work at seven hours at my new job because that's what they're saying seven hour shifts which is easy as hell by the way especially when when you're used to working 10 to 15 hour days seven hours of janitorial work versus you know 10 12, 15 hours of hard construction and labor work that's that's a big difference so this is going to be easy for me i think because been a janitor before it's not a hard job uh the only physical is just barely bending over and scrubbing some toilets or picking up some off the floor uh, maybe carrying heavy garbage bags but you know it's easy it's not heavy to me you know so the neighbor here's got a whole bunch of flags down around the property I don't know what that's for you guys have any idea okay Kiko Kiko's over here peeing come on come on Kiko so anyway yeah I need the extra money video editing is perfect for me I know I can do it and I'm really good at it <clears throat> and I'll do a better job for for Kyle um, you know I would do better than you know on my own videos to be honest I've edited so many of my own videos sometimes I you know kind of just throw them together half-ass it you know um, just because I've done so many and I'm so good at it so that even my my half-ass work is sometimes just just fine you know pretty much always is just fine so I don't know, like, I'd like to get to the point where I could hire someone else to do my videos because I know they wouldn't do the half-assed job and, 
you know, they would do more detailed. I don't know. There, there's days where I put in the detail on my own videos, but you know, it's just, it's weird, you know? Like when I used to be a janitor before, I'd clean the heck out of the, the bathrooms and keep the place really clean. But then when I would go home, I wouldn't, you know? It's, it's like, you don't, you, you do for others, but you don't do it for yourself sometimes. It's, it's weird. I don't know how to explain that, but I don't know. I'm sure some of you get it. <clears throat> but anyway, so yeah, when I'm editing for someone else, I put that 110% every time because yeah, I want to keep their business and I want to make them happy. And uh, you know, we'll edit these videos and hopefully, uh, hopefully he can get some uh, good views coming in and some subs, get some some supporters, <sighs> and also. When he does get this channel going, I'll definitely uh, let him know, let you guys know, let you guys know about it, so you can go check him out. You know, we can give him kind of a, a jump start. You know what I'm saying? Walking, Kago. Yeah. Why don't you stay on my side? You stay on my left side. Yeah, stay on the left side. Yep. Good doggy. Yeah, the sun is shining. It's nice and warm out here. I had to guess it's probably around 50 degrees. It doesn't feel like December to me. It's kind of funny. I did see a weather guy say something about there's like a kind of a nasty storm and cold front coming in. Um, it's gonna hit the west coast. And I think he said in the next like couple days or sometime this week, I don't know. But yeah, I guess we're gonna have to worry about that a little bit. <clears throat> I don't know. Um, they said something about like really hard rain and I don't know if he said anything about snow but yeah if you guys know like when I get hard rain and I get snow sometimes I get stuck here because you know the water goes over the driveway and it goes so high I can't drive through it so <sighs> hopefully that doesn't happen this year hopefully and we got a little airplane <laughs> it's as far as my phone will zoom <laughs> I wish I could have a better camera, that's for sure. That'd be cool. And we're at the railroad tracks. <laughs> it's a good doggy. Yeah. Anyway, there was a mix up with my new job. Uh, unfortunately, I uh, was going to go call them and set up the uh, orientation appointment. They just wanted me to fill out all these papers and stuff and send it back and take the drug test and get a um, a food card. So I did all that and I called today and she said something about they didn't get my background check. And I'm like, well, I filled out all the forms you needed. Everything that she sent to me in the email, I filled it all out. And um, I'm thinking she just didn't send me the thing about the back background check. I'm pretty sure she did not. I might be mistaken. I don't know. Maybe she didn't send it in the email. Maybe it was in one of my papers. I haven't checked, but I don't know. I always thought that background checks is something they, they just, you know, do. As long as they have your social security number and your name, they can run it. And I don't have to do anything else. I don't know. But she said three other employees that they just hired also didn't complete the background check so i feel like maybe it was something on her part that she forgot or something i don't know but kind of sucks because i don't think i'm going to start work tomorrow and she says background checks can take up to eight eight days it's like oh huh, i gotta get to work you know what i mean gotta make that money damn it so i, don't know, I was a little frustrated about that a little stress and stressed about you know my high car payment and was trying to find a way to refinance it today and <laughs> so I pay 20% interest rate like 20.5% on my auto loan <clears throat> and I pay 383 per month as my payment 
and then I have 230 a month for full coverage insurance because of my bad driving record currently. That does not help things. But yeah, 383 a month and 20.5% interest rate. It sucks and uh, it's hard to pay them steep payments. And so I was trying to refinance, but you know, I'm upside down. Now I'm currently like 40, I think $4,200 upside down on the loan. And so, like, nobody will refinance. Capital One said they would, but they would change my payment from 382 to 542. So they're gonna raise my monthly payment and they would give me 15% interest in a two year term, which is a lesser term. But I can't afford 383, so why the hell do you think I'm gonna be able to afford 542? That's crazy. So I called him. She said something about if I paid like $1,600 on my balance, that would make me less upside down. And they would make a deal where it would be like $282 a month with, uh, I think she said 15% interest rate again, something like that. Which is still not a great interest rate, but the payment would be a little more manageable than... You know, 383. I can afford 282, I think, you know. I don't know. <clears throat> it's just the, the new job with lesser pay, man. I'm trying to make this work. Shit stresses me out, though. God. It's always about money, guys. Can't, you know, enjoy life without thinking about money or worrying about money. Or... It's kind of annoying. It's even like when I'm streaming, like I'll stream for, you know, eight, ten hours or whatever. I did all that work, you know, and there's a lot of streams where, pretty much most of them, where I don't get any, like, donations at all, and that, that affects me. It's like, ah, I need the money, and I'm not doing it just for money, but it's like a big picture in my head, you know? <sighs> just wish it wasn't. I wish... Nothing had to do with money. Like, I just not even have to think about it. Not even have to worry about it. It would be really nice. And just, you know, enjoy my gaming. Enjoy life. And do what I want to do. Know what I'm saying? See, they got them coming all the way down. The other side of the property, too. Around the whole property, I think. It's crazy. I don't know what that's for. I don't think they're trying to sell the place. Such a nice place. Unless they're trying to move to Alaska or something. But I don't know. They're, they're, they're there a lot, so I don't know. <laughs> anyway. I am heading back here. We got our walk in. We had fun making that little Kyle B. Newman thing. <laughs> uh, I was just, I was having fun. Man, I was wearing a different shirt for every time. I was going, like, Kyle. Cut, cut. <laughs> I thought it was funny. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, but yeah, I was just kind of showing like kind of what I can do. I can do a lot more. Uh, like I could add special effects and explosions and you know things that pop up. I can add memes that pop up on the videos or whatever. You know, I don't know. So yeah, kind of like whatever you want, like. Basically, you can send me the like video clips. This is how I was doing it when Pixel Guy was editing my videos. Is I would uh, I'd send him the clips like in a Dropbox, and you can use like Google. I actually have a Google Drive or whatever. And I think everybody has that. But anyway, um, yeah, you send the clips that way, and then I download them and I edit them and uh, basically make it one video. And I can either, you know, upload it and do the thumb, thumbnail SEO and, you know, close captions if you want them, everything. And, uh, yeah, wouldn't be a problem. Like, I do that all for you. So, let me know, man, if you want to hire the commander. Definitely could use the extra money and it would probably reduce a lot of stress, man, if I had something to you know, supplement the income a little bit to where like, <clears throat> to
to where like I could at least survive, you know. I wanted like a, you know a little, and then some. But I mean, right now I just I, I just want to survive, man. That's all I need. <sighs> yeah, that ends in some. I think will come later. We'll keep pushing with this YouTube thing and uh, keep going with the gaming, and we're never gonna stop. And we will succeed. It's just inevitable, you know. Hard work always comes reward, and sometimes you gotta have patience and wait for that reward so it doesn't just come overnight. So, that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to be patient. A good walk, mister. Do you have a good walk? What are you doing smelling his butt? What are you doing smelling his butt? Alright, come on. We're gonna go in. Come on, buddy. It's good boy, yes. Okay. Alright, so my back is hurting a little bit, but uh, I'm going to hit up these weights just a little bit. I'll do at least one set, maybe two sets. Just a little bit of a pump, you know what I'm saying? There's 10, do 10 more here in a second. I wasn't sure if I did 10, so I did an extra, I think. We well, did 11 that time. All right. Alright guys, so I'm going to make me some kind of lunch. Got to figure out what I'm going to make. I don't know. Um, I got pizza. I probably shouldn't eat pizza, but I'll probably eat that. <laughs> I don't know. I got to get more healthy food in this house, that's for sure. This has got to, I got to do more grocery shopping. I did get some pears. I got some pears, and I had them the other day from the same place. But this time when I got them, they were like really hard and not juicy and like only a little bit sweet. So I don't know what to do with that. Maybe I got to let them sit in the fridge longer. Maybe they're not completely ripe. I don't know. I don't know anything about pears. All I know is the other ones are really good and these ones aren't that good. So maybe I'll wait a while. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, guys, I'm going to close this one off. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, smash that like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Comment down below in the comment section. Not just the chat, but in the comment section too, please. I really appreciate it. And let me know what you... What you think? What you think of my audition thing? Hopefully you guys thought it was funny and uh, got some humor out of it. <laughs> That's usually what I've tried to do on this channel. I'm trying to entertain y'all. So anyway, uh, but yeah, appreciate you guys so much. Have a good day. Peace out.